right? Don't leave uh, Qatar and go to Patong. I plan to take a bus if I will find it. But first, breakfast from my <laughs> regular place where I was eating every day. Breakfast and dinner from the same lady where I rented the motorbike. She's a nice lady. I recommend go there. Price is the same like everywhere. Here in Kata, 70 baht for like noodles and stuff. Curry is like 120. Tastes good, fresh. There's never really lots of people when you pass by, but it's good. The lady is nice. She will bring you a free a small plate of uh, fruit <laughs> after your dinner. So try it out. So the place is just here. You, know, you might see almost in the corner. Where the sign for car and motorbikes is. Here. Okay. Time for breakfast. Oh. <laughs> Good morning. My last meal in Kata. And then we can move on. The same that I took the first day. Sunjiba, <laughs> very good. Nice fruit. Bye. Right, so. That's the place. If you're here in Kata, come. Oh, there's a nice lady, she will take care of you. So now, mission to get to Patong. And I asked her, she told me there's really no bus. So, I will try Grab, which is the taxi. You can order it uh, through the apl application, through the app. Uh, and it shows you price straight away. <laughs> so, Hey, found a lady driver, Tuk Tuk Thailand. Found a Tuk Tuk? Yeah, Tuk Tuk Thailand. Yeah, Tuk Tuk Thailand. 400 baht? Yes. So, soon gonna be there. Where you come from? Actually? Latvia. Latvia? Oh, no, no, no. Ah, you don't know where it is? Yeah, I know, I know. <laughs> yeah, I look, I Google look, map. <laughs> I look at Google map. <laughs> ah, exactly. <laughs> okay, there. Google map very good. Yeah, okay, okay, okay. Ah, from there. Okay. Thank you, will you be? Thank you. It's okay, don't worry. Okay, thank you. Thank you. <laughs> Great. Have a nice day. Same to you. Thank you, thank you. Bye bye. It's a cool ride actually. Look at this. Like a king. <laughs> so, 400 baht. I checked the grab. Grab told me 560. So I thought, if I can get the tuk tuk 400, 400, I will do. And that's what I did. <laughs> so I'm going down the road to Putong Beach. There I'm gonna get out. I just told them to throw me out on the beach, don't need to bring to the hotel as I can walk, it's uh, what, a few hundred meters, you know, <laughs> it's nothing for me, as the traffic there is a bit, you know, so it's easier for them, I don't mind to co cooperate, you know, do good to others, others will good, do good to you, that's the idea, okay, so, Bye bye Tuk Tuk. Yeah. I'm in Patong. Had to walk a few hundred meters to my hotel. Where and the then hotel? I can street the, hit the streets. No, 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 I walk. It's very close. But thank you. Maybe tomorrow. <laughs> right. Right. I'm basically here. I already see it. The building with what the white and red, uh, those squares there on there. As the windows. 
Batong Terrace. Alright, gonna go in, check in. My room probably not ready yet. It's two o'clock, but I can wait. Leave my bag. I'll be good. Right. So I checked in. It's two o'clock. At two o'clock, I can go in my room. But they didn't like. Uh, they asked a two thousand baht deposit, which wasn't mentioned when I booked it. But well, let's hope. It won't be some kind of cheeky scam or shit. <laughs> Definitely, I will let you know if, if it will be. I'm sure it will be fine. So now, I'm gonna go, I don't know, probably to the beach. Wait for two hours. And then go, leave my bags. And uh, then we can really start to explore. I try later Indian. I'm dying for that. And I have heard that Indian food here is very good. Is there? Later, yes, later. <laughs> you from India? Is the chef from from India? No, Pakistan. But it's similar, no food. It's good food. Oh, okay, later. I come later. <laughs> so I heard that Indian, mostly Pakistani food. It's good here because there's there a lot of uh, people from these countries and they make really good authentic food. So I would like to try that out, you know, a little bit for the change from Thai. I do love Thai, but change someplace is needed. <laughs> and seafood here. I mean, this probably is the place where to get a good fresh oh, yeah. okay. thank you where <laughs> uh, to get a good fresh seafood is usually the food is alive when you order <laughs> and then it turns magically on your plate on your table so I did that yesterday I had this fish which unfortunately I didn't film I don't know why because I'm stupid, that's why, but I'm sure that I'll have another one another day and then I'll be sure to fuel. Right. Right, the famous Bangla Road. Obviously, even though it's, there's plenty of people, obviously, it's only 12, but in the night time, this gets wild, as I've been told. Probably around six, seven. That's where it's. Uh, that's when it starts. Can't wait. Looks promising. Looks promising. You, you should take here, stay here as many days as pubs are here so you can enjoy one pub every day properly but then that probably would be your entire <laughs> Phuket journey as it's quite many of them here <laughs> that looks like a promising name of a bar, Moonshine Bar <laughs> I wonder if they really sell Moonshine there if they do, I would definitely want to go and try it. As I personally believe that moonshine is one of the best alcohols you could drink. It's much better than uh, vodka or much better than rum, whiskey. Fuck those. Moonshine. If it's made properly, of course. <laughs> Back in Latvia, we have, a, I would say, more or less rich moonshine culture. So trust me on this. <laughs> and if it's made properly, you won't have a hangover. You won't even be really, really drunk. You will control yourself. But if it's made properly, that's the important part. As you need to know what you are doing with this stuff. Right, we're at the beach.
Gonna sit down somewhere, chill a bit, relax. And in one, one and a half hour, gonna head back to see, see the room. Sailing, no water, you can make video under sky with Baton Beast. Yeah, no. <laughs> you want to do parasailing? No, 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 thank you. I don't, I don't want well, to do it though. Well, to be honest, parasailing would be kind of cool. I can actually ask him how much it costs, just out of curiosity. Brother, just out of curiosity, how much? Not today, maybe tomorrow. But you know, you can do like that, but up to wind, you know. Not yeah, yeah, every yeah. day like this wind, you see, like that. Yeah, yeah, yeah. That Need a good wind. Yeah. And how much does, does it cost? The one. Uh, parasailing, 1,050 baht. Yeah. And how long? Allow the baton. It's like what? I don't know. 10 minutes, 20 yeah, minutes. That is, that is. Something like that. Yeah. Okay, I'll think about it. All right. Thank you, brother. See you when you're going to fly, okay? Sorry? See you when you want to fly. Yeah. <laughs> no, thank you. No coconut. <laughs> Alright, so 1500 bar. I assume something for like that. For like 10, 20 minutes or so. The idea is tempting. It is tempting, to be honest. And the views probably would be fucking amazing from the sky. I will think about it. Can't promise, but I will think about it. Definitely way more uh, people here on this beach, way more tourists than on uh, Kat and Karon beaches. But it's supposed to be like this, I mean, this is a party place. I, I assume it gets pre pretty wild and uh, loud during night time. <laughs> Great. For those who drive around with a scooter, and plan to park here on the beach of Potong like this guy don't do that <laughs> police just came put a chain through the wheel and left a note pay a fine <laughs> I don't know how much but if you don't want a unfortunate surprise for yourself don't do that find the proper space this looks <laughs> something that I would want unfortunately here in Thailand it is not legal only in the medicinal cannabis is legal it's just approved actually I'm not sure if it's even uh, the law is uh, accepted yet because I think there needs to be some kind of month or two month grace period but this uh, what is legal basically it's uh, allowed to have only CBC and no THC and uh, <laughs> We all know that THC is the one that we want. <laughs> and it's a shame. Because it's a great, great to chill, you know. And the weather here is perfect for amazing sativa. <laughs> so unfortunately, there's not really an option. Those of sport bars I've seen. <laughs> so very almost like a uh, western uh, style but probably I would say this is probably the least authentic Thai uh, place sort of thing do you know still of course a uh, very nice place to visit very beautiful interesting uh, plenty of uh, Thai culture here of course but if you want this like specific like Thai culture probably uh, old town probably would be where you would get it, obviously Bangkok, but I'm meaning the confines of Phuket Island. <laughs> Top 
Maybe later, yes. Not now, but not now. Yet. Not now, not no, now, now, good price. Good price always. <laughs> so, a small street. You can buy clothes, t shirts, Hello. shorts. Hello. How are you? Uh, Perfect, how are you? Okay, very good. Nice. Got my room at 1 o'clock, hour earlier. Thanks, God. Can take shower. <laughs> See what's the story. Beautiful. Okay. So, oh, finally in my room. Oh, 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 oh. Doesn't look bad, doesn't look bad at all. Ooh, range shower for 10 uh, euros a night. Seems pretty decent. Gonna take a shower. Have a small rest and hit the streets. Hello. Hey. Hello. So central town. Small market. So 50 or 70 baht, depending on the size, for what's called smoothie, basically fruits blended with ice. In this weather, really amazing thing. Fresh juice. Very good. Omega nut, like cenure. Very good. Very good. Very good. Very good. Very good. So. Omega nut. It's very good. Yeah. How much is one? Uh, 60 baht. How much? 60. 60? Yeah. Okay, I think, I think. Look, but looks good, looks good. <laughs> so 60 baht for fresh juice. And a bottle. I've bought one of them before. Uh, it's really nice. Refreshing. So go for it. How much is one? Chicken. How much? 70 baht. 70 baht. And these small ones? Uh, smaller, 20. 20 and 70, yeah? Yeah, and 50. Yeah. Yes. Can I get one this, please? Yes. A cut? No, no, like this. Like this? Yeah. Okay. 70, you say, yeah? Yes. Yeah. Right, so 70 baht for that. And that was 20, I believe, right? Getting one. What time it gets busy? At 9, yeah? Yeah, at 9. At 9, yeah. <laughs> after, after 7, it's okay. Half 7, okay. Until 11. 11. 11, it's finished, closed, yeah? Uh, uh, 
Or depends from. Yeah, yeah, yeah. Uh -huh. Okay, okay. Tell me, how much is uh, this piece? Uh, we will check for you first. 100 gram, uh, 70 baht. What do you have to check? Uh, 100 gram for 70 baht. Yeah. And that like, is like, like, like 300. Yeah. So it's like. Like up 7. Yeah. Okay, later. Yes. Or tomorrow. Uh, yes. It looks can, very good. Yes. <laughs> very good. Can, can eat when you want to some. Yeah, yeah, yeah. No need, no need to buy all. Yeah, but I want all. <laughs> yeah, yeah. I, I mean that. Maybe some people like, why? Oh, I don't know. Too much. Yeah. You, you can eat. It's not, it's not uh, it's still cold. You come back. What happened? No, no, it's okay. It's, it's so it looks good. very good. I think it's okay. Bye. Thank you. Thank you. Very much. Right. Gotta try it out. So the big one is this like 100 grams. 70 baht for 100 grams. The big pork belly strip. It looks fucking amazing. So later on, I might come and try it. Now, let's try this. Okay, very good. I guess it's good. I don't have my musicalization because <laughs> music will kill it. <laughs> but yeah, it's very good. Right. Then I'll we'll finish this small bite. And then we will see what happens then. <laughs> right, that's it, right? That was nice. How much is one stick? Just some pork. Yeah. Just chicken. Uh, just some thirty baht. Yeah. Thirty baht. Thirty. Yeah. So uh, basically the. Only thirty baht. Thirty. Yeah. yeah. That and for one. Yeah, one yeah. steak. Yeah. Okay. Okay. So I might come back. Later in the evening, when there's more people, it's gonna be more fun. Because the, those actually skewers looked uh, really nice for 30 baht. Sounds like a good deal, to be honest. You too. <laughs> okay. Let's go. What's the story? The boss Taylor, sir. I don't need suit. It's too hot. Not only suit. I make the shirt. Only shirt, only pants. You see, I'm traveling for one year everywhere. I, ah, one year. I, I need shorts, uh, not pants. <laughs> I make the short also. I'm going later to India. Ah, so you need a linen shirt. <laughs> you know, because India is also same like this. Yeah. I make a short sleeve. I will think about shirt. it. How much yes. does it cost? Uh, we have a depend the material. Yeah, it depends from the size. Yeah, no, not the size, <laughs> but we have a linen. Yeah. We have a cheaper, medium, good like this. Okay. Yeah, we have a depend. Well, tell me middle, middle quality. Middle, we have like maybe seven, eight hundred baht. Seven, eight hundred yeah. baht. That sounds good actually. Yeah. You can see here my shop. I will see. I will not buy now. Yeah. I will not buy now, you but can I can see. Yes. I will be here for a week, so. A week, yeah. In yeah. Potong. So how many countries you've been already? I don't know. 30, oh, 40. Oh my God! All, almost all around the world, huh? Yes. Okay, <laughs> yeah, yeah. let's see. Yes, sir. Yes, sir. So it's like this, yeah? Yes, sir. And you take a me measurement, yeah? Yeah, we do. We give you the measurement and we give you the fitting. Okay. Because you are here one week, it's actually, it's a perfect. You got some, uh, you need to try one, two time at least. Okay. Problem. And different this, materials. Yeah, and also like this, this is the silk. This is the Thai silk. Yeah. That's very fancy. Yeah, because uh, it's for, not for business, for summer. Going yeah. out like this, you see with the dragon patterns. And this mm -hmm. also, we have many colors. Okay. And this is the one which is the cotton. No, I'm I'm not that fancy. For me, only if one I, color. If I, no, if I take then linen, but I will think about it. Oh, okay, okay. Because in Latvia, I'm from Latvia. Oh yes. We yes. Can also do linen. Okay. It is our yes, cultural, sir. Uh, like. Uh, yes, sir. Yes, sir. Material, you could say. Yes, sir. Okay. What's your name? My name is Sunny. Sunny. Yes, sir. Nice to meet you. Nice to meet I'm you. Elvis. If you need to come back, yeah, please. Okay. Thank you, sir. Right. Okay, linen is actually a good idea <laughs> because it's hot. So I will think about. It. Thank you, Lenny. Uh, sunny, sorry. <laughs> so 
Uh, linen, yeah, linen is a uh, perfect material in a uh, hot weather, as it's like super breathable, super light. It's like very good for such weather. So uh, we will see. Most likely, I will not, but I did want to see what's inside the uh, shop. <laughs> Let's be honest, you know. Ruit. Small shops, as everywhere. Ooh, that's like a... Oh, and we're back on Bangor Road. Okay. Right, I think we're gonna go there. Right, this looks a fun street. <laughs> looks cool, I don't know. Cool. All right. So I decided I will have this uh, garlic naan from this uh, Indian small cafe. And later on in the evening, when I get more hungry, I might come back and have tikka masala because that is my favorite. Tikka masala and garlic naan. No, now only naan. Tikka masala maybe in the evening because I'm not that hungry. Okay. I just had chicken. <laughs> okay. Okay, what's your name? Kumar Singh. Kumar Singh? Yes. Yeah. I'm Elvis. Nice, nice to meet you. you. Nice to talk to you. Right. <laughs> you sit here, so I'm happy. What very good, you know? very good. <laughs> yeah, in the evening I might come back definitely and uh, try. Uh, but the meat dishes. Maybe yes. cheese man, sir, because the cheese man won't need anything else. You can eat myself the cheese man, but the garlic man is a after you. No garlic. I love I like garlic. Okay. I love okay. garlic. Okay. <laughs> but thank you, thank you. Okay. Look at this. A garlic naan. And what sauce is this? This is the mint sauce. Okay. Mint sauce. Oh, it's a, it's a, I like it. I can feel it a bit uh, chilly, so we will try. Any type of the hearts put inside. Okay. Mm. Mm. Beautiful, beautiful. I like that here in Thailand you can have authentic Indian food if you want to. And Indian food is beautiful. So if you want guys, look for this guy. <laughs> he will sort you out. Right, I will leave this now and talk to you later. Thank you. Thank you. See you later. See you soon. Right, so this is on the street. Like that. And then you go. And you see this. Right, let's go to the beach. Same to you. So later on, my come, crack his masala. <coughs> because if we can believe him, he has the best one in all Phuket, or at least Patang. Probably all of them say that, but who knows, maybe he's so lying, he's telling the truth. So I guess we have to find it out. So this naan was 70 baht. And it was, no, it was really delicious, really good. Right, move on. So, cool small bars here on the beach. <laughs> Sit down, have a drink, enjoy, chill. What else you would like? And it's outside plus 30 something. 31, I believe, today is. So, come enjoy. Yeah, oh, thank you. Looks amazing. Yeah. <laughs> 
<laughs> so. Plenty of people. Day is ending though. It's five. Hello. Hey, uh. Hi, Patong. Welcome. <laughs> Come <laughs> to Patong. <laughs> Patong is the place. Very serious, actually. <laughs> But usually, usually they go like this. <laughs> Rules only exist like 50-50 semi. <laughs> right. Okay. I think uh, I'm finishing this day vlog. I'm gonna go home, shower, and prepare myself for evening. This evening will be wild. Right, see us. Check this.